In my first episode, I mentioned a Quebec City-based company, Soucy Aquatic. The company did a great deal of work on this installation. In the examination of one of the jets, I learned of another company in the fountain business, Crystal Fountains. Mechanical engineer Roger Zerre founded the company in 1967 in order to collaborate with Canadian sculptor and architect Gerald Gladstone for Expo 67. Crystal Fountains' head office is in Toronto. It also has an office in the United Arab Emirates and opened its Warsaw office in 2010 to serve Central and Eastern Europe. According to the company's website, the 3D programming software controls the pumps, jets, lighting, and music to create the display and control the fountain remotely. This urban water attraction is known for its elegance and outstanding architecture. Pool and Hot Tub Council of Canada recognized this project with a gold award in the Water Features category. The company is actively involved in R&D in the industry, and from seeing what I saw at Place des Festivals, there are clearly very different design features at this fountain. From exploring Crystal's website, I learned that the reference to 3D programming I mentioned earlier is the industry's first physics-based 3D simulation design and programming control suite called Waterlab. Fountains with lighting features warrant a special nighttime visit, as separate episodes. The interplay between lighting, refraction of light, and water and timing at this site must make for an entertaining and interesting display. Lighting in contemporary fountains use light emitting diodes, and those installed at Place des Festivals are designed by Crystal Fountains, who claim to have thousands of installations globally.